Hi guys, in this video we're going to show you some of Hilo. This is Rainbow Falls, but we'll come back to that at the end of the video. Hilo is on the eastern side of Big Island and is the oldest city in the Hawaiian archipelago. The city looks over Hilo Bay and is at the base of two shield volcanoes. Mauna Loa, which is an active volcano, and Mauna Kea, which is now dormant. Hilo has a tropical rainforest climate, but you can see it's wet the day we were filming. It's often wet, something like 240 wet days a year. This is us driving down Banyan Drive. It's also known as the Hilo Walk of Fame, as all the Banyan trees here were planted by celebrities. The trees are huge now, and have survived several tsunamis that have devastated the town in the past. We stayed at the Hawaiian Hotel, which is off Banyan Drive. It's a medium priced hotel, and we had a room at the front overlooking Coconut Island. I still remember the cocky frogs singing at night. They were incredibly loud, and so many of them. We're now arriving at the Japanese garden. We're going to have a walk and take some photographs. There are some beautiful trees and plants here and of course the black volcanic rocks. Hilo is the fourth wettest town in the United States, averaging a mind-blowing 10 feet of rain per year. But please don't let the rain stop you visiting Hilo. It rains at fairly predictable times and won't mess up your plans to enjoy this tropical and lush side of the island. This is the bottle brush flower and I'm sure you can see how it gets its name. Big Island is overrun with these furry creatures. Mongoose were introduced in 1883 to control the rats in the sugarcane fields, but unfortunately it failed as the mongoose feed in the daytime and the rats are nocturnal. Now they have become a pest on the island as they prey on the birds and turtle eggs. There's a lovely bridge over an ornamental pond in the garden. This photo was taken in 2017 when the sun was out. If the sun was to come out and dry this park up now, it would be absolutely beautiful. It's never crowded, which is nice. These little yellow birds are called saffron finches. I see quite a lot of them. They're really great to photograph against black volcanic rocks. Ah, this is a view from Coconut Island from our hotel room. Rainbows occur every day here because of the rain. And this photo is taken from Coconut Island back towards the hotel. Here is a close up of the Banyan trees, very complicated structures, home to hundreds of cocky frogs and other creatures, really fascinating trees. Now we're back at Rainbow Falls. Rainbow Falls has an 80 foot drop and a 100 foot diameter. 
the falls are part of the Hawaiian State Parks. There's no fee to see the falls and there is a car park very close by so it's very easy access, no hiking and really worth a visit. It's called Rainbow Falls because in the mornings if the sun is out you should see a rainbow in the water mist. Thank you for watching guys and please subscribe to our channel.